Okay, so we're going to, we're in the training course, um, practicing and learning and um, getting some hands-on experience with the new uh, implant drilling protocol and the N1 implant. And we're practicing here in some blocks and mandible and eventually cadavers. So we're going to start with our osseo director, which, re which uh, rotates at 2000 RPMs. It happens to be set at 2000 RPMs and 10 Newton centimeters. And the markings, the, the black markings here, not certain if they're visible, are 7, 9, 11, and 13, but be cognizant of the fact that the tip of the osteodirector is one millimeter longer. Um, so you just have to be careful of vital structures. I'm a big fan of counterbalancing when drilling. So I always use two hands, always, when drilling. And we're gonna drill this to about 11 millimeters, which is the bottom of the second black marking. And we're done. Then we will set this for the osseo shaper protocol, drilling protocol, which is 50 revolutions per minute at 40 newton centimeters. And we'll do that to 11 millimeters as well. And this doesn't really need much of a counterbalance. It kind of finds its own way to the full depth. And we'll just kind of keep an eye on the 11 millimeter depth marking. And we're just about there. And now we will reverse that out. And that is basically the protocol in almost all types of bone other than exceptionally dense bone. And at this point, we will be placing our new implant. It's placed at 25 uh, revolutions per minute at 70 Newton centimeters. And basically, the implant just follows the osteotomy created by the osseo shaper. Now what we can do is make sure that we align the flat side to the buckle. We can take a, our new uh, torque wrench, our implant mount, and need be necessary, just make minor, minor adjustments and rotations such that we align it perfectly in the mouth for our restore the partners. And there we have it. Thank you, Boom. I think it's uh, game changing. Um, fewer burrs, fewer, uh, less potential to heat up the bone, Paul, less potential to create this cellular death zone. Um, so I, I think it's just going to be game changing. And, you know, it doesn't surprise me that Nobel is on the cutting edge of this uh, new drilling protocol. So very impressive.